hey, 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 oh, oh, oh. Oh, hi guys, I'm still harassing that woman from the previous episode. Welcome to episode four, I believe, of my playthrough of this game, and I'm still looking for them batteries. I can't remember where they are, it's been... Oh, when was this, when did this game originally come out? I think I played it the year after. So it's been a couple of years since I've done it. Uh, no, not down here. Well, what about here? What about here? Nope. Nope. No. What are, where are these batteries? No, okay, I'm, I'm completely stumped on where these ba batteries are. I think they might be still in here. I don't know, I'm going to go look outside with, uh, I think his name was Doug. Just How because I think that will advance Good. the plot. Want to go have a look around a outside? Little bit. Uh, let's have, let's a look. have a look around. Okay. KFC or something. He just eat. As far as I can tell, that's all they care about. And if one gets you, they eat you. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. How the fuck? I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. Think you can do anything with this? You know what I could do? What's that? It's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. I just hope the power is still on. You can just do that? Well, I memorized all the codes when I was in AV. Let's try. Fucking done, Doug. All that dork nonsense might save a life. Who's to say it already hasn't? Well, that was pretty cool, actually. I like that. I got a few of them to take notice. But not enough. I'll try to change the channel on it now. Those TVs are on, and I'm sure they're making a lot of noise behind that glass. Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. Hey man, what are you doing? We can't even think about going out there unless the keys are out there for sure. It's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah, hmm. it didn't work. Any idea where the pharmacy keys might be? We searched high and low inside before you guys got here. They weren't on the old couple we took out of the office. Are you okay? I'm fine. If the keys aren't in the drugstore, think they could be out of here? Now live in a world where getting up and walking away is an actual possibility. So. Right. That guy over there has the keys. How can you be sure? I found this in the office. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we can make. Yeah, I agree. Just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. You wouldn't need long, right? Nah, just a few seconds. Maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. I can't reach that brick.
Hmm, I'm gonna look around. Open sesame. That won't work. I was kidding. It's universal, but not that universal. I know, Doc. How'd you end up here? I moved here to live with my uncle. He just texted up and it just made sense. So you're local. You probably knew the owners of this place. No, not really. I've only been here a couple months and I spend a lot of time. On the computer? No, just doing my own thing. What about you? I grew up here. Been trying to get home since the day I came back. Oh, so you probably knew the owners then? Yeah, I did. Good people. this gate so far and the drugstore is safe enough i think whoever owned it took good care of it it's well stocked and locks up well we should think about searching that guy across the street maybe he has them but who knows if he actually worked here what's everyone like in there oh well, Carly's pretty nice, you know. <laughs> yeah. Lily doesn't take any crap. She's been running the show, keeping people on watch, things like that. And her dad... Yeah, that guy. He's kind of a dick. Pardon <laughs> my French. You speak French? Oh my god. <laughs> Doc, you want to get this door open? About that. You've got the combo, right? No. Did anyone ever have it? Look, man, there were a lot of those things trying to get in here. And now we can't get back out onto the street. We're also party to some egregious fire code violations. I can't reach that brick. I've got to knock that lock over there. I imagine going out the back door and around is out of the question. If we're going to help Larry, we need to get this lock off of there. Hmm. Why well, can't I reach the brick? I can't reach that brick. Sure, you can reach that brick. Man, that's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah, it didn't work. Those TVs are on, and I'm sure they're making a lot of noise behind that glass. Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. All right, shut up. A bunch yeah. of guys okay, I've done up everything, everything this guy has to interact with now. I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. What am I missing? I go back in. Let's head back inside. Okay. Where is he then? Cherokee hardware in the background is near. I like Cherokee hardware. I'm gonna get back to him. Sounds good. Okay, was a waste of time. Why couldn't I open this door? Uh, the keys are on that zombie out on the street. All oh, right, that's why. So they just directly reference these quote unquote walkers as a zombie. Right there. So oh, what is that? So it looks like I've gotta go in here and tell the people that the keys are outside. If you don't mind, I think my yeah, family and I are gonna not. rest for a bit. Let me know if that asshole over there takes a turn for the worse. You got it.
Mm, okay. Central High Tech State. Papers a week old. Feels like years. Oh, what's this on the floor? Ah, there's the battery. I knew it was in the shop. Doing my nutting. Right, here here you go, woman. The battery. And here's another one. Should be able to get it to work now. It's still not working? Yeah, I can't figure it out. Let me have a look at that thing. Go ahead. You silly bin. You put the batteries in the wrong way. As the you fixed it. Continues to spread unchecked. The estimated death toll continues to skyrocket. WABE urges you to stay indoors and avoid any contact with individuals you suspect may have been exposed. The station is okay. In the event of a full... Uh, uh, my, my producer's telling me we have to get off the air. Steve. Hmm. Yeah, he fixed the radio. If you don't mind, I think my oh, family and I are gonna rest for a bit. But clicking on Duck would uh, over there give me a different response. The Kenny is telling me You've to basically it. bugger off. Oh, and all she does is tell me that he's gonna he's he gonna get back to her dad. I'm gonna get back to him. Sounds good. God damn you, woman. Hey, Connie. You seem to handle yourself pretty well. <laughs> really? I'm a disaster. I can't tell. My news editor was eaten about five feet away from me, and I would have joined her if it wasn't for that dorky guy on watch over there. I'm sorry. She was an asshole, but, you know. Yeah. That guy saved you? Yeah. Can you believe it? Those creeps, or, or ghouls, or whatever the hell they are. They were pulling our van apart, and that guy, Doug, just came to the rescue. You can never tell who the heroic ones are gonna be, I suppose. He's kinda cute. In that parent's basement sort of way. Huh? Huh? Oh, nothing. That radio sign-off didn't sound too good. Are you okay? I'm fine. You're really fine. All of your colleagues are probably dead. You don't think I know that? Of course I'm not fucking fine. God, Lee, just leave me alone. No, I'm going to talk to you more. Hey there. How'd you end up here? We drove up to cover the Cherry Blossom Festival. Real hard-hitting stuff. Sounds worth it. Better get back to it. Yep. Thanks, by the way. Don't mention it. Just remember what I said. Yeah, I will. I think I remember what I have to do. I have to go with this woman to go save the other dude. And then when we come back we get the uh we get the keys off the zombie. I'm not I'm not entirely sure. Let's you go. You ready to head out? You got it. You? Yeah. Let's go. Shit. Get down! Oh, dear. Oh, no. Oh, no. Did 
Did you see that? Sure did. Be ready to shoot. Guys! Oh, man. I'm glad you're here. Jesus, Glenn. Uh, right then wasn't so hard. Can we get out of here before any of these things notice us? Not yet. There's a survivor trapped up there. No way. We gotta go. Now. Listen, I was out here looking for gas. And then, up there in the corner room, I heard crying coming from inside. Who is it? It's a girl. We talked and she got frightened. I was trying to get in and help her and she started yelling and saying I was bitten. I tried to convince her I wasn't and that's when all these guys came out of the forest. A, a couple almost got me and I ended up hiding in the ice machine. Lucky you. Now let's go. We can't just leave her. Damn right we can. You guys are suicidal over a girl. I'm saving her with or without you. Think about if it was you. Fine. Let's go save Glenn's damsel in distress. Hmm, I break this glass. Are they gonna come eat me alive? Hmm, stop it. Ow! Hey man, that drew some attention. Be careful. Yeah, I figured it would. I didn't want to go up, I wanted to go to the right, but it won't let me. We can do something with that car, I bet. If it weren't for that fellow looking near the front. Hmm. Let's keep looking around. You need to find a weapon. Yeah, the trouble is, I'm trying to remember what I did on my first playthrough of this game. That's why I'm going a bit slower than what I probably normally would. Take this sack thing or whatever it is. Go over to the car, punch the window out quietly. That'll make sense. I wonder if there's anything in the pickup. Yeah, go to it then, stupid hippo. What are you gonna do with that? Any tricks for getting into cars? Not without tools, or making a bunch of noise, and none with pillows. 
What are you gonna do with that? I don't really know. Do you have any tricks for getting into cars? Not without tools, or making a bunch of noise, and none with pillows. I'm done trying to punch out window. Oh, okay, maybe not. The plan doesn't work. Get out your gun. But the noise. Just follow my lead. Stay right behind me. Ah, there we go. That was sick. Okay, well that's enough for this episode, let's see what I do with the, that zombie and that one just over there, you can just see him. So thanks for watching this episode guys, we'll catch you all later, stay tuned for the next episode. Peace.